It pleads because it knows I am its master. I will finish this. The brain is on the cusp of its final thought, and it's taking all of the Emperor's strength to keep it there. An opportunity, perhaps. You glimpse the lifelong destiny promised by your father. Enslave, dominate, ruin. In your father's name, you must seize your rightful claim to the brain, not destroy it. If you do not, then he will flay and shred your mind, so it cannot even comprehend the horrors he will plague you with. I know what you're thinking. So let's do it. Let's seize the whole damn world and be reviled together. What in all the sweet hells are you doing? upon legions of unborn mythics. The pain rips through you, obliterating all thought, all feeling. Your tadpole burns in your brain. quiet of your father's disappointment before the rush of your tragic fall.
your thoughts wander from your companions and everything you endured to your own piteous fate. If only you defied your father when you had the chance and freed yourself of your dark desires. But it's too late now. Your destiny is set. Your very blood shall clot with the urge and that hungry desire will consume you. You may have freed the world from the control of the nether brain, but you are not yet free. Your father is angry. What foul punishment awaits you now that you have rejected him? doing no you've butchered so many before each death a gift to your father this one you will take from him this one is just for you Flickerest there, the poor brave soul who hath defied the lord of murder, the madman in king's clothing. With thy death thou hast given life to all the lord of murder would see undone. Thou hast made good on the promise of thy better heart. Tell me, adventurer, hero, friend. Do the voices echo still? Thou deserveth as much. Let thy mind be its own place thou mayst sow and reap. Ah, <laughs> what sweet fruits might such fertile ground yield? Thy life may be forfeit, but thy death hath only begun to unfold. What awaiteth thee is a mystery, even to me. I cannot account for thee, adventurer, hero, friend. But I know thy story endeth not here. Death itself hath many byways, and thou might yet have a new and different role to play. Even now your desires threaten to consume you. Your only hope is that a prison will be sufficient to contain you while you spend the rest of your life pondering your sins. But it seems your father has other ideas. Thou remainest in thy chains, separate from the light of the world, removed from its temptations. Thou feared thou would be a slave to thy desires. Dost thou still fear that which lurks within thee? Hast thy cruel father taken all of thee that thou once was? Amid the ravenings of thy cruel sire, thy soul intact. The realm of men will forget thee, books left bare to be filled with falsehood 
myth and superstition. The tapestry of fate, however, will not forget, nor will I. Rest well, friend. Thou deservest as much. Till next we meet, remember, thou gave all thou wert to save lives, to reclaim the world from a fate most dire. Well done. I see. Poor, piteous soul. The realm of men will forget thee, books left bare to be filled with falsehood, myth, and superstition. The tapestry of fate, however, will not forget, nor will I. Rest well, friend. Thou deservest as much. Till next we meet, remember, Thou gave all thou wert to save lives, to reclaim the world from a fate most dire. Well done. The balance of the world restored. The balance of these lives, mortal and otherwise, brought to account. To you! <laughs> Many killing moons have waxed. As each set, more your mind waned. No mortal cell could hold you. The bars broke like bones. You pray with each new heart spillage. You worship with your diseased embrace, siring a mad legion. You scream, for you cannot speak. Yet, in the treacle pulp of your brain, something called you back. Here. What is this place? It was something, once. Bonds, warmth, strength, fear, love. Now you feel only impatience for these blood sacks to sleep, so you can strike with the death dream. Each time you unhinge your maw, the words of the prophet tumble forth. Not long now, not long. Wait until they are at rest to strike. Patience. Worse than an animal. It all flows freely now and mingles with the gall. Your body is not yours. The revelry is falling to a lull. Your witching hour draws close. Kill them all, Mad Balban. Kill them all. Just like that, it's over. Whatever's left of you is subsumed by the overwhelming strength of your desires.
the balance of the world restored. The balance of these lives, mortal and otherwise, brought to account. To you. Many killing moons have waxed, as each set more your mind waned. You pray with each new heart spillage, you worship with your diseased embrace, siring a mad legion. You scream, for you cannot speak. Yet. In the treacle pulp of your brain, something called you back. Here. What is this place? It was something, once. Bonds, warmth, strength, fear. Love. Now you feel only impatience for these blood sacks to sleep. So you can strike with the death dream. Each time you unhinge your maw, the words of the prophet tumble forth. Not long now, not long. Wait until they are at rest to strike. Patience. You are Baal Stallion. Many of your own Baal spawn have been born to die in this half year. Your new children will become the tyrant's horde. Why do you spare even one thought for your forsaken mate? Neither Saluna nor Shah will claim her in the end. Baal wants her more than those graven gods. The revelry is falling to a lull. Your witching hour draws close. Kill them all, Mad Balban. Kill them all. Just like that, it's over. Whatever's left of you is subsumed by the overwhelming strength of your desires. The balance of the world restored. The balance of these lives, mortal and otherwise, brought to account. To you. <laughs> Many killing moons have waxed. As each set, more your mind waned. You pray with each new heart spillage. You worship with your diseased embrace, siring a mad legion. You scream, for you cannot speak. Yet, in the 
the treacle pulp of your brain, something called you back. Here. What is this place? It was something once. Bonds, warmth, strength, fear, love. Now you feel only impatience for these blood sacks to sleep, so you can strike with the death dream. Each day you sing his hymns, each night you dream in red. Not long now, not long. Wait until they are at rest to strike. Patience. Iron. Salt. A stagnant marrow treat. The revelry is falling to a lull. Your witching hour draws close. Kill them all, Matt Balban. Kill them all. The balance of the world restored. The balance of these lives, mortal and otherwise, brought to account. To you. <laughs> Many killing moons have waxed. As each set, more your mind waned. You pray with each new heart spillage. You worship with your diseased embrace, siring a mad legion. You scream, for you cannot speak. Yet, in the treacle pulp of your brain, something called you back. Here. What is this place? It was something, once. Bonds, warmth, strength, fear, love. Now you feel only impatience for these blood sacks to sleep, so you can strike with the death dream. Each day you sing his hymns, each night you dream in red. Not long now, not long. Wait until they are at rest to strike. Patience. You have cultivated these crusted companions, wrenching, ripping, scraping. But you do have a favorite. Scratch, 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 scratch. One day you will excavate all the way down to your thrumming heart. The revelry is falling to a lull. Your witching hour draws close. The pity gags in your gullet. Yes, they will die. Yes, just for you. 